Matt Marvel and Simon Talbot. So Simon, this is a plane? Yes, this is a plane. This is our, um, it's our transport taking us, well, who knows where, to be exactly. honest. Exactly. It's French, apparently. Tell that by its kind of... <laughs> little, little Gallic flair that it's, uh, that, it, that it's got there. So are you nervous? I'm not. We're in very safe hands. I'm, I, I'm a nervy fly, but I'm completely. I'm looking forward to this experience. It's a shame I'm going to be blindfolded. What about the rest of the day? Okay, so the flight is exciting, but then we've got, we've got to get back to Ipswich. I haven't been thinking about that. I'm, I'm more nervous about spending time in the wild with you in, the, on, in, in this brittly cold weather than I am about anything else. Okay, I think we should do it then. Okay, chocks away. If I said the word ailerons, would you be impressed? Yeah, absolutely, yeah, yeah. yeah. You've okay. been if I said, up. what does it mean, Simon? <laughs> I have absolutely no idea. I thought it was a band. <laughs> I take. Okay, bags are being loaded on. I've got a handle to hold on to there. I've got to walk on a black strip. You want to step down into the back there. This is very much just like a, a car, other than it's got wings. So Simon's in the plane. Do we have seat belts? We do. do we, are we meant to wear them? Yeah, I, I would suggest you do, yeah. <laughs> okay, right. I've got my headphones on and it really blocks out the noise very effectively. So the headphones are connected. I, I'm not wearing them, I'm wearing the ones for the recording device. Pardon? What was that? It's, it's, Simon can't hear me, he's wearing his headphones. So it, I presume we're taxiing all the way to the other end of the runway to come back again along it. Unless we are just driving there. Check the engine is working and uh, everything is uh, all looking good before we go. Okay. And is it looking good so far? Yeah, it's, it is. Yeah. Woo! Exits here, here and here, let's rock. Yeah. Okay, we're building up power. Here we go. Going off to farms. If you want to put your blindfolds on. Okay. We've been instructed to put our blindfolds on, so this is it. I now can't see anything. Feels feels quite relaxing flying blindfolded. Feels like feels like you're floating. Two blindfolded men in a plane. That says something. I'm not sure what though. Okay, that was a weird sensation. Presumably we've just gone, uh, lost some altitude. Being blindfolded and losing altitude and slowing the engine down all feels very odd. We can't be far from our destination. Okay, so we've been, he's trying to take our blindfolds off. We're just circling around a field, some trees, some weird sensations. Obviously we're coming in for a landing. Here we come. Coming in for a landing, who knows where. Down we go. We're down. We're down. Lovely landing. Well, let's stop before we turn it. First impressions, it's flat. Very similar to where we've just taken off from. Some undulation on the left with some trees and a big, big house. Wouldn't it be funny if we just got around a big circle we were about where we started? That would be funny. Here we are. Touchdown. How did it feel actually flying two people that were blindfolded? Uh, well, it's quite relaxing. They weren't <laughs> saying much. <laughs> no nattering, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> The perfect flight. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Okay, which way do you reckon we should be heading then? Down that way, the way we the way we've just landed. Okay, and you're gonna turn around and fly off home. I'm gonna fly off home, yeah. Uh, so we don't know where we are. We've been dropped in the middle of a field in the middle of nowhere. We're running away from a man in a car <laughs> and our and our our plane is about to take off leaving us behind. Okay. 
So there he goes. If you just listen, that's our lift. It's what time? Do you know what the time is? Quarter past ten by my uh, Christmas watch. I feel I feel like some um, we're in some sort of spy movie. We've been like, we've been dropped behind enemy lines. Now we've got to make our way back to base, maybe. Back to the BBC Radio Suffolk, yeah. the studio, the broadcasting house in Ipswich. That's the goal of all do we this. Have a, do we have papers? Do we have a disguise? Can you speak the accent? Watch your, watch your step, because there's a horse manure there. See, I'm not bothered about horse manure. I'm wearing walking boots. Oh, no, and I've got my espadrilles on again. <laughs> when will I learn? And it's a beautiful day. It is, it's a bit of hazy cloud in the sky. I'm sure um, Ross would know the proper terminology for that kind of cloud. Aileron. Priming the engine. We showed him, didn't we? We certainly did. He thought we were a couple of numbskulls. 